I am going to show you how to create STRM files to be used in your XBMC so you can watch live TV using your HD Home Run Networked Tuner. First thing we need to do is download the program. And we're going to use this one here, HD Home Run Build Version 0.9. We're going to download that. Alright, it's completed. Now we're going to create a folder called HD Home Run Stream Builder, which you already did. So I'm going to bring that over, open it up, there it is. Now I'm going to open it up, I'm going to extract it to the folder that I just created. Extract it. Everything's extracted. Now here's what it created with in that folder. That's the folder. There's every, everything extracted. We don't need that anymore. I can delete that. Now here's all the files extracted. Now here's the one you used to run it. Now first thing we need to do is go into settings and tell it where everything's at. Okay, we need to know where our silicon dust config is. Click on browse. And that is in the program file silicon dust home run. That one right there, the config. Click open. The UNPN. Now I have a tuner that's also got UNPN capabilities. There's nothing there. So I'm going to discover it. Now I'm going to look. Now I've discovered quite a few things. So I'm going to take the first one. That's my tuner. Also to use the MC2XL. That's another little program that gives you the guide data. That's another uh, video. Click Browse. I need to find that. Now I have that on my desktop. And I call it original MTX folder file. Click on the exit. Click open. Now the, the STRM folder, we're going to make that on the desktop. That's where it's going to create the folder. Click OK. Now everything is set up. Now what we need to do, go to File, Tools, and do a channel scan. Right now it's scanning all my channels. So I'm going to pause it till it gets done scanning. OK, in the process of scanning it, it opened up that program MC2MXL in order to get the TV guide. So I put my zip code in there. Click Continue. And since I'm using over-the-air antenna on the roof, I select the Digital Terrestrial Lineup. Okay, now, as you notice, it's all done. It found all my channels. So some of these I don't want. So I'm going to check, check them all, and I will uncheck the ones I don't want. Okay. 
it finds channels that I really do not receive that well. So I uncheck the ones that I really don't receive that well. Okay, I've got them checked. Now I'll go to Tools, go to XML, and I want to write Okay, and I also want to export the stream files, S-T-R-E-M, so I'll click on that. Okay, now what it did, it just created a folder with all my uh, files in it. So I'm going to minimize this, I'm going to minimize that. Here's a folder that it created called Tuner Zero. Each one of these S-T-R-E-M files is a channel, TV channel. So I'm going to close that out. I'm going to open up XBMC and show you how to import those. Okay, I've opened up XBMC. Actually, it's called Kodi now, K-O-D-I. So I'll go to Videos go to files I want to add video I want to go to browse I put it under my C drive it's under users run desktop and it's called tuner zero click on that click on OK Click on OK. Click on OK again. Now, it created a folder called Tuner Zero. Here's all my channels. Channel 2, click it. And now, I stop it. But that's an easy way to have all your channels from your HD, HD Home Run using XBMC.